Hello and welcome to this week's coffee vlog. It's now Friday the 22nd of April and I'm heading home at half past five. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Not terrible. Um, this week it's been a um, bit of a licorice all sorts really I suppose. It's uh, not been a huge amount on, um, but Again, one of those things where uh, with work, you have these little quiet, quiet bits, and then it all happens at once, like manically, and you can't get it all done, and then it goes into another little quiet bit again, which is uh, it's a bit annoying to be honest. But it'd be a lot better if we could just have a nice, consistent, steady amount all the way through the week. But that never happens, does it really? So, uh, been pretty busy, and obviously got a bit of a a build up now two weeks till this event in London to uh, to face so um, there's stuff to sort out for that still need to finish updating that new website I did because of course that will be kind of a big feature for this um, this event in, uh, in London as well so yeah lots and lots to do uh, what else has been happening with me? Um, obviously been playing a little bit, not too much, a little bit of Star Wars Battlefront. Um, did manage to finally get round to um, making good use of the two PS4 systems to do an online multiplayer with the youngest. Um, which was quite good, it worked as I thought it would do very well. Um, him sat on the living room TV and me sat in front of the MacBook Air um, playing on remote play with that one and uh, yeah we had a good time cracky look at that voxel go like a rocket not so much me and I'm being really beaten up by uh, ooh, that orange one right there so I'm gonna have to let him go unfortunately almost I'm gonna sneak across here ah, but he won't gonna let me in it's a 6-4 plater though isn't it Speedy, is he gonna let him in? Go on, let the little Renault in. Poor thing, burning oil like mad. Um, look at this, the van behind me is gonna be right, not impressed. Yeah. I'm going again, I'm going again. Good stuff. So, yes, uh, we got to do a bit of um, two player in it, which is great. Teamed up, um, obviously, making use of a feature that probably half the gaming population already use, which is, is sort of this uh, online multiplayer friends matching up sort of thing. Um, being a bit of a billionaire, mate, <laughs> and also, of course, the problem with me is at the time that I'm getting to play games generally, you know, post midnight, um, no one else is gaming. <laughs> so um, that sort of online multiplayer is not so great for me, but um, yeah, we've got to play about together, which is good having some game matches because I had the odd occasion where I'd uh, be off trying to get someone um, you know I'd be stalking some of the opposite teams ready to take them out and then all of a sudden I'd be getting blasted from out and I went who the devil is shooting me because I wasn't dying either which is even more bizarre because the reason that I wasn't dying is because someone on my own team was shooting me and next thing is of course the youngest giggling away to himself ah I got you I've just found you <laughs> but yeah, yeah but we're on the same team you're not meant to be shooting at me you're supposed to be getting the bad guys or good guys depending on which side you're on of course Imperial or Rebel so uh, that was some great fun um, also just generally been batting on with it I've not actually made the great leaps and bounds I've made when we had the uh, the double score weekend so uh, I'm not shooting up the scoreboard anymore but um, yeah I've been enjoying I'm enjoying the remote play I'm playing more because of the remote play um, but of course unfortunately for youtubers I'm not watching so many YouTube videos because uh, when I would be normally watching those now I'm diving on remote play and playing a bit of Star Wars Battlefront instead so sorry about that I'll try and catch up on a few videos when I can um, talking about YouTubers as well, I uh, I got a, a comment here, I got a comment, and I, no, in fact that reminds me, I apologise because 
I'm not very good at responding to comments on these vlogs, and I should be, but what happens is I probably end up playing Star Wars Battlefront again. Instead of, but, um, so, a lot of the time I, I get comments and then I kind of think, oh, I will respond to those, and then three weeks later I think, oh, I better go back through all the past vlogs for the last few weeks and respond to any comments. Um, and there's always a comment from Bob, so Bob, sorry that I'm so slow in responding. I mean, I do try and comment on your video straight away after watching it, or even while watching it. Um, but, uh, yeah, kind of failed badly in that sort of um, responding to comments. And I, but I had a comment from um, a new a new subscriber, a new subscriber, or a new book watcher. So that was, um, that was great, thank you very much. Uh, and that was Paul W, I'll drop a link to his channel. Um, because he kind of does vloggy things as well, which I went and watched, and um, yeah, it was very entertaining actually. I really enjoyed it. So, um, subscribe to his channel as well. Look forward to more of his sort of vloggy content. So, good stuff with that. Uh, I really enjoyed. I really enjoyed it. He did um, like a vlog, but he was going to. Um, I was an American channel, but it was it was going with his son, uh, teenage son, I presume. He looked kind of teenage anyway. Um, to go and replace a gaming mouse. So this was like the third time they replaced this mouse. His son was insistent, sticking with the same brand. And I was like, well, that's so persistent. But the son's like, well, these are the best gaming mice. But you're and I'm quite right. It was like, well, the thing is, it can't be that good because you're now on your third one that isn't working. You buy it new, you get it, and there's something wrong with it. Um, but <laughs> it did it didn't make me laugh. But um, there was persistence there on you see, if it was me, I'd mean like, look, stop buying these rubbish razor ones, they might say they're the best, whatever. You just want to get a good old Asus bog standard mouse, that'll do the job, won't it? Easy. So, uh, but yeah, so um, no doubt it costs a ridiculous amount of money, these razor gaming mouses, but um, yeah, it's, uh, it was very entertaining to, to hear them banter on as they're on the way there. So, yeah, that was good, I enjoyed that. And talking of mouse or mouses or input methods for computers, um, Magic Trackpad 2, uh, a week in of using it, I can safely say it's as good as the original one. That's about it, really. One major bonus I have found is it doesn't wander across the desk like the old one used to. So normally I'd start with it next to the keyboard here, and by the afternoon I'd be over here somewhere, way beyond, because, um, yeah, it just, the original one just wandered around the desk, I don't know if the rubber feet had worn a bit on it or whatever else, but, uh, yeah, new, the new version, trackpad, just sits exactly where it's supposed to be, um, the virtual click thing, it, it does feel like it's clicking, even though it isn't, and you know it isn't, but it feels like it is, which is just a very unusual experience, but, it's good, I've not used any... Let's get that car's weird headlights then. Um, yeah, not used any really of the force touch features that much. Um, and other than that, it's taking a lot of effort to get used to the fact I don't need to stick my thumb down near the bottom left corner to click, because you can just click absolutely anywhere now. But um, I'm getting there slowly, just taking a bit of time to readjust to this new experience but it still just isn't worth what Apple want for it new I don't think it is I mean I'm sure designers and whatever else would perhaps you know if you do a lot of graphics work and it's perhaps really good for that maybe I don't know would say it is worth it but to me you know I'd just get the original one because the original one does just about the same job, you know, lacking a few little bits, but on the whole, it just works the same, really. I mean, for £59, I think it's great. I really like it. But, you know, there are some little benefits there for me, but, you know, 110 list, no, I really, I couldn't, I couldn't recommend anyone to buy it over getting the original one. To be honest, I'd just get the original one. Um, 
I don't even know if Apple lists that anymore. I've probably delisted it now because the new ones are better. Um, but obviously you can pick the original ones up very cheap. In fact, I should be doing a listing for one myself very soon. So no doubt I'll be I'll, able to link an eBay uh, link for that if I get round to doing it. I've not actually got round to doing it yet. But... So, um, yep, yeah, Apple Trackpad 2. More, more beta updates. In fact, I just updated the, um, the MacBook Pro. Um, because the 10.11.5 beta 2 updates out now, so I had that update, and uh, the watch has reliably informed me that it wants updating, or it has an update pending, but uh, I've not got round this week to, to sending out those, uh, or installing those latest updates. I might do that tonight, well, actually, no, I won't do that tonight, no, it's not going to happen, I don't think. Um, so, not really paid any attention to what's new in these beaters though, if like it's just bug fixes or whatever else. Um, not watched anything movie wise particularly, um, so not a lot going on there. You will notice I'm actually in my, well, t-shirt. Um, Last few days been lovely. Today actually it seems to go on rubbish and I get the impression it's not going to be that great over the weekend which is just typical isn't it. Lovely and sunny for the last few days while I've been stuck inside and for the weekend it's going to be rubbish. Lovely. So uh, that's not great but uh, I mean, it's still not bad, it's not freezing. Ooh, caravan, lovely, that's what you want. Uh, go on holiday. So yep. Not the uh, not the greatest now it isn't. We were out till late yesterday. Oh, did did lawns with a strimmer. Uh, still not got round to to get in that mower. Shed ideas are abound, um, but not progressing hugely well with that either. Yeah, general lack of progress to be honest. Right, I am off in. So enjoy your weekend and week next week and uh, yeah, I'll catch you in next week's coffee vlog.